guys, it is Arika Misha, and today we are cooking curry chicken over white rice. And I am using the Instapot today for my curry chicken. All right, and today I'm doing the drumsticks. I've already got, of course y'all know, they've been marinating overnight, marinating overnight. The curry chicken. So, and I'm using the drumsticks. Um, I just put some curry, a little onion, garlic, a little pepper. Um, I did a little uh, spicy. I added a little New Orleans spicy just to give it a little extra kick. Um, and yeah, I just, those are the only uh, seasons I use on the chicken. So, I've got my chicken broth, my college in 100% natural chicken broth. All right, I'm going to go ahead and get my chicken in first and then I'm going to put my broth in. So, I'm just going to lay these drumsticks in here. Putting my drumsticks in first, and then I'll put in my chicken broth. So I'm just getting these all layered in here. Oh, that curry smells so good. I'm gonna get it in my Instapot today so that the, the curry chicken is all nice and juicy and tender, and the meat just gonna be falling off the bones. Y'all gonna see it when it's finished. And I'm going to put it in the Instant Pot in case I forget to tell y'all. I'm going to cook it in the Instant Pot for about 40 minutes. Got my chicken all layered in here. I'm going to cook it for about 40 minutes to make sure all my drumsticks get all nice and cooked. All nice, juicy, and tender. Get my hand washed here. All right. Let me see if I can. Get y'all in that pot. Y'all know I be lifting y'all up. I need to adjust my thing so y'all so y'all see how I got that chicken all nicely layered in there. Y'all see it. Y'all know what it's looking like. So let me go ahead. I'm going to get my chicken broth in. I'll probably just do two cups of this chicken broth. And like I said, I'm going to cook it for 40 minutes. All right, so we got one cup. I'm just going to pour it all over my chicken. One cup of chicken broth. Pour my second cup of chicken broth. And I'm just going to, you know, pour it over my chicken. All right, yep. Two cups. That's all we're going to do. Two cups of chicken broth. This is something quick and easy, guys. Quick and easy. Throw it in your Instapot. Let it cook for 40 minutes while you do. I always, <clears throat> excuse me, I like throwing stuff in the Instapot. That way I can do other stuff around the house. Everything I need to do, other things I need to do, I just go do it while my food's cooking. So, all right. So, we got our chicken in there. We got two cups of chicken broth. I think I said that a million times already. Two cups of chicken broth. All right. So, let's go ahead. Let me get my... <clears throat> Let me get my top on. Now, remember guys, make sure you got your top on. Make sure you got it turned and locked. And of course, your Instapot lets you know. Um, you know that everything's all nice and locked. Let's make sure we got, make sure we got this right. Hold on. All right, let me make sure we got this on right. Okay, hold on. Let's get you back on. Get you back on here, right? Okay. Let's get this back on. Okay, we got that back on. All right, so. Make sure we got it. Okay. We got it locked. We got this on closed. We want to make sure we got that closed and not on venting. So we've got that nice and closed. All right, and I'm going to go ahead, let me bring you guys back so you can see. I'm going to set it for, let's manually set it. I'm setting it for 40 minutes. And I'm going to tell it to go ahead and start. So, of course, it's going to take time to get all warmed up, you know, all heated up. Take about five minutes of that. And then it'll go ahead and start cooking. All right, guys, so... We've got our Instant Pot all set for 40 minutes. We're going to go ahead and let it do what it do. And then I'm going to move over here over to this rice. All right, let's get this rice cooked up real quick. And of course, you guys know I am using my minute white rice, my ready and five minute rice. I love this rice. Nice, fluffy, quick rice. 
You gotta get it. You gotta get it. I mean, get rice cooked in five minutes. All right, and today I'm doing something different with my rice. I mean, I've done it before, but I don't think I've recorded it for my channel. Um, I've got my college in chicken broth. Same thing I used on the curry chicken. So we're gonna be using the chicken broth instead of water. So, all right, so I'm gonna put in here three cups of chicken broth because I'm cooking three cups of rice. Of course, you know, same cups of rice, same cups of, um, for your rice, same amount of liquid. All right, so we gotta get this boiling. Three and three, three cups of my chicken broth. I'm telling you, use chicken broth for your, um, use chicken broth to, uh, for your, to replace your water. And it gives your rice a whole new flavor. Whole new flavor, y'all. Trust me on that. Instead of using water, of course I use water, but I'm just saying, use the um, chicken broth. Man, gives your rice nice, juicy flavor. You know, gives it a little chicken flavor. Just gives it a little extra, you know? So, I'm gonna go ahead and um, because I'm waiting on this to boil so I can pour in my rice. So, all I'm gonna do, once this starts boiling, guys, I'm gonna put in three cups of my rice. Now, listen to what I'm saying. I've cooked this on my channel before. I'm gonna go ahead and let this get to boiling. My three cups of water, uh, I'm sorry, chicken broth. Three cups of chicken broth. I'm gonna go ahead and let that boil, boil, boil up. And once it boils up, once you have to wait for the uh, liquid to start boiling. So once that starts boiling, I'm gonna get three cups of my rice, pour it in, and then I'm just going to take it away from the heat and cover it up for five minutes. That's it. Once it starts boiling, let me repeat that. Once your liquid starts boiling, pour your three cups of rice, however many cups of rice you're cooking. I'm going to put my three cups of rice in here, stir it up, remove it from the eye, remove it from the heat, sit it to the side over here. I'll probably use my back eye and I'll put my top on it and let it sit for five minutes and that heat from the uh, liquid cooks the rice done in five minutes i'm telling y'all i love this rice y'all seen me cook this rice on my channel before i'm always cooking this rice i love this rice quick and easy but it's good it tastes good nice and fluffy rice i love this rice this is my favorite white rice the minute rice is my favorite white rice let me show y'all that again cooks in five minutes it really does so i'm gonna go ahead and let this get the boil and do what it do and then i'll be back with the grand finale because that curry chicken just beeped over there so it's ready so I'll be back with the grand finale. All right, this time it done run off. So let's go ahead and get to the curry chicken. Get my top untwisted already. Oh yeah, I done let that pressure out. It is hot. It is hot. See if I can get y'all in a little closer so y'all can kind of peek down in there. All right, let's see. The curry is hot. Our rice is almost done. Ooh wee! All right, let me get my dish over here. You know what? Let me put y'all down here so y'all can see this dish. Okay, let's see. Yep, cause I'm gonna put the curry out onto this dish. So that's what I'm finna do. All right, let's get the curry out. Ooh, it's looking good in here. Ooh, it's looking so good. Mm, 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 mm. I love the curry juices. Let's see if I can get my plate right. Ooh, look at it. I'm just falling off. I love cooking in this pressure cooker. I love it. The curry juice. Let's see if I can get my plate to sit right. Come on, plate. Because I don't want my juices all sliding. And that's our rice. The rice is finished over here. Cut this timer off. Okay. All right, timer. Okay. Ooh, wee. This chicken looking so good. Ooh, it smells so good. If y'all could smell the curry. Oh, my God. Mmm. 
Mm, 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 mm. Bring y'all in a little bit more so y'all can see better. Ooh, wee. All right. Trying to make sure I keep my meat on the bone. Mmm. Oh, yeah. That's some good eating right there. That's some good eating. Mmm. Mmm, 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 mmm. All right. Well, finish getting the rest of the chicken out. So good. It smells so good. And my juices, I'm just going to lay this over my chicken. Chicken, lay this over my chicken. Lay this over my rice. Mmm. I'm pour some of that curry juice over it. Now I wish I had me some plantains. That's all right. That's all right. Oh, this smells so good. Mmm. Smells so good. And I got some pieces of chicken in here. Y'all know I'm getting all my stuff. We trying to keep my chicken. Ain't nothing left in there but juices. Mm, mm, mm. Oh yeah. Oh, that tastes real good. I found me a little piece to check to check out. Oh, that's good. All right. So, let me unplug my Instapot. Let's move that. Let me move the chicken over here, y'all, so y'all can see it better. Let me turn y'all around. Hold on, y'all. Hold on. Ooh, the curry chicken. Mm, I'm going to leave y'all right there. But you know what? I got to show y'all the rice. Hold on. Got the rice. Then five minutes. All right. And you just take your fork and lift up your rice. See that? Nice and fluffy rice. Now, remember, we cooked this rice with that chicken broth. So that rice going to have so much flavor. That rice gonna have so much flavor, we ain't gonna know what to do. Mm-hmm. Yes. Nice and fluffy rice. Take y'all back to the good stuff, to that curry. Ooh, to that curry. Mm-mm-mm, to that curry chicken. And I ain't talking about the basketball player either. Ooh-wee. I'm talking about that curry chicken. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. Y'all see it. Y'all see it. Y'all already know. I got to pour some parsley over the star of the show. I can't, can't do it without putting the star of the show in there. Can't do it without putting the star of the show. Y'all hold on. Y'all know I got to put the star of the show in here. Let's get our chicken all. Let's get the chicken laid all pretty. Let's get it laid all pretty. Let's get it looking real pretty here. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. It's hot. Hot, hot, hot. Oh yeah. Let's get it all pretty. Looking all pretty. It's smelling good. Y'all know I like my food to look right now. Presentation is everything. How you present yourself is everything. All right. Let me put that across there like that. Okay, that look good. Mm, that look real good. Where's pasta, child? Come on here, pasta. Let's go on and put this pasta across the top of the curry chicken, y'all. Before he get the tripping. He all right. Ooh, the star of the show is on the chicken. Let me take y'all in. Mmm, it's smoking hot. Nice and hot. All right. Let me get some, let me get some parsley on my rice, too, now. Give me some parsley on the rice. Let's get some. Let's get our rice all fluffed up. Okay. Let's get some parsley on our rice. Get our rice looking right. All right, y'all. We got parsley on the rice over there. We got parsley on our curry chicken. All right. You seen me do it, so you know I did it. This is Arika Misha. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my social media, guys, at Arika Misha. And don't forget that knowledge is power. Thanks, guys. Bye.